forest management plan is a document developed with the landowner's goals and objectives in mind. We'll create a written management plan that's uh, melding together the landowner's short-term, long-term interests and what the ecology of that forest is. It, taking into account water resources, the soil productivity, the wildlife resources, and then what is the actual vegetative component of that forest. A uh, forest management plan at least contains the following. You have a title page which gives landowner information, plat and lot number. The next the section typically is a property overview, acreage, size, watershed, Shed, topography, and then you get into the details where the forest is broken down into stands or management units where stands are based on age class, diversity, composition, and also stocking levels and soil. A management plan also includes a recommendation section which is the most important because that guides the landowner in future management and it's also broken down into a timeline. Meeting with private landowners to develop management plans based on their goals and objectives qualifies them for a favorable tax assessment. If someone's interested in wildlife habitat and encouraging a variety of habitat conditions on their property, the stewardship plan will look at how we can meet that goal. If it's improving the timber value for future harvest, then we'll look at that aspect of it. And often, these things can all happen at the same time. In our current plan, we're focusing on three areas improved trails, wildlife habitat, and overall forest improvement. We've been able to accomplish those three practices in this current plan. We really wanted to be able to get into the woods. We wanted to be able to walk them on a regular basis and enjoy the different aspects of the property. We developed a forest stewardship plan that would open up some trails into the back and improve on forest health conditions by doing some thinning in certain portions of the property. A forester designs the plans so that they are very respectful of the long-term goals and of all of the natural resources. The management practices reflect good, sustainable management.